of your MC this evening, and welcome to Bad Broadway. So my job tonight is to tell you the context of some of these shows that did not exactly do great on their original run on Broadway, and it's your job to sit back, have fun, relax, get some food and drink anytime throughout the show, and have some fun. Over the years, Broadway has offered us some shows that through no fault of their own did not quite find their audience in their original run. For every Rent, which had a 5,123 performance run, there's a Soul Doctor, which had a mere 66. And that's not to say Rent's a better show, it just found its audience. Tonight, we look at some shows that did not quite find their audience the first time around. Let's start with a story. In 1991, a book was published that caused a bit of controversy worldwide. It was banned in some places, and in other places you have to be 18 to buy it. In 2000, Christian Bale started a movie remake of it, and in 2016, American Psycho opened on Broadway. 81 performances later and two Tony nominations, both for design, it closed with a killer soundtrack exciting audiovisual designs, and a main character who charmed audiences into rooting for a serial killer, it should have become a smash. Instead, it closed before it could find its place. In the show's opening number, sung by Will, Patrick Bateman tells us about how materialistic the 80s could be. Everything I'm telling you is a song I'm selling you It's uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh 